My name is Cannabis Rollins. My journey is beginning. A journey that I hope will open the doors of life to me and link my past with my future. A journey that will bring me to a strange and dark place. From Hammerfell to Skyrim to a house called Rollinwood. A world that I have never known with people I have never met. People who tonight are still only shadows in my mind, but who will soon fill the days and nights of my tomorrow. Hey, Hill. Hill here. Gaming. The Night Mother has spoken to me again. And wants me to speak with Nazir. It's hard to believe that we're the only three people remaining. In the Dark Brotherhood, everyone else slain. By Sithis, what a mess. I guess this is the end. Not necessarily. And only if you want it to be. By Sithis, what a mess. I guess this is the end. Not exactly. The Night Mother has spoken to me. Again. What? Well, what did she say? I must speak with Amon Motier once more. Amon Motier? But that would mean... The contract is still on. The true Emperor must be assassinated. You mean there's still a chance? But how? Our plan has gone to ruin. Everyone is dead. The family. Our family lives on, Nazir. You have to trust me. <laughs> All right, then. Go. Go, my listener. Find out what that slimy bastard Moltier has to say. Then send the Emperor to Sithis. Ah, but when you're done, there's no use returning here, is there? I was thinking... The Dawnstar Sanctuary. We could make a proper home there. Listen, when you're finished with this Emperor business, meet Babette and me there. I'll find some way to move the Night Mother. But don't worry. Now go! And come back with a barrel full of gold, huh? Babette, my girl, pack your things. We're moving. I was hoping you'd say that. And don't end up with a broken wagon wheel. You just worry about fulfilling the contract. I'll take care of things on this end. Very well. But I don't want to see you broken down on the side of the road with the Night Mother's coffin. You just worry about fulfilling the contract. I'll take care of things on this end. All right, then. <laughs> Babette? Well, I'm not sure if I'm going to miss this place or not. I think I might. <laughs> That's too bad. All right, it's time to go. I'm sure this will be the last time I ever set foot here. Hmm, it's night time. There. Just adjust my vision ever so slightly. It's better. All right, let's see what we're doing here. The Night Mother has spoken to me once again. The true Emperor must be assassinated. The contract with Amon Motier must be completed. And where is he? Hmm, white run of all places.
Here we are. White Run. Let's see. I think Amon Motier might be in the Bannered Mare. Come on in. Just stoke the fire. Take a seat and get the cold out. Ah, there. So, it looks like a bond is back here somewhere. What is it? I said I didn't wish to be disturbed. <laughs> we have unfinished business, Mortier. By the gods, you, you're alive. But I had heard your sanctuary. Please, you mustn't think I had anything to do with that. I wanted the emperor dead, the true emperor. I still do. It was Morrow. He... The Emperor. The real Emperor. Where is he? You mean, after all that's transpired, the Dark Brotherhood will still honor the contract? Why, this is astounding news! Wonderful news! The Emperor is still in Skyrim, but not for long. He's on board his ship, the Katarai, and moored offshore in the Solitude Inlet. But you must hurry. If you can get on board that ship, kill Titus Mead II as contracted, I will reveal the location of the dead drop that holds your payment. I have a few more questions, though, before I leave. Commander Morrow, where is he? Ah, <laughs> yes. I can imagine you'd want to settle that score. Last I heard, he was at the Solitude docks conducting the Emperor's departure. This ship, the Kataraya, how will I get on board? Well, I don't know. It's in the Solitude Inlet. That's the channel just north of the docks. I suppose you should go to the docks and swim? <laughs> so flippant, Mortier. What kind of security should I expect? Surely you're joking. This is the true Emperor, not some half Septim lookalike. He'll be surrounded by elite bodyguards, I'm sure. You'll have your work cut out for you. Still, everyone assumes the Dark Brotherhood has been completely destroyed. They may be a bit more lax than usual. Please, make haste. The Emperor's ship won't stay moored forever. We won't get a chance like this again. <laughs> we. Very well, Mortier. Don't you have all the information you need? Please, the Emperor isn't going to kill himself. <laughs> now wouldn't that be a blessing? Mortier, I'd be careful with what you have to say. Don't you have all the information you need? I do. Please, the Emperor isn't going to kill himself. <laughs> now wouldn't that be a blessing? The Emperor may not be the only person that dies today. Keep this that in mind. Favorite, one of the first songs I ever learned. Ragnar the Red. Oh, there once was a hero named Ragnar the Red who came riding to Whiterun from old Rorik's stead. And the braggart did swagger and brandish his Say If it's work you're looking for, Hulda's the one to talk to. Mm -hmm. But then he went quiet in Ragnar the Red when he met the shield maiden Matilda who said, 
So, Solitude Docks, Commander Morrow. Shadow Mayor. In the name of the Yarl, by the order of the Yarl. What? Stop right there. Is there any chance I could talk you into overlooking this? All right, but you just watch yourself. Next time I might not be so lenient. Then pay with your blood. Somebody help! What? Ah! Never should have come here. Oh, so my persuasion attempt succeeded and then failed. Going to have to kill them all. someone else. All right, it seems to have quieted down. Who is this woman? Apparently killing her caused me to fail something. Well, enjoy her blood then, and yours. All right, there's no telling. Yes, I figured as much. Who's gonna attack me now? A dog? Are you serious? I think it's all right for me oh to no. leave now. Oh my god, this can't be happening! <laughs>
He's just standing right there. Hmm, killing in broad daylight. I see they're going to make this difficult. Come on, you can't see me. So there's five guards. I'm tempted to kill them all. Still invisible. <laughs> Imagine that. All right, Commander Morrow. I just had to come in. See my work. I'd say it's been a pleasure, but it hasn't. Come quietly, face the yard's just by the wood of the yard. Stop right there. How you can't see me. All right, I'll just pay this off. I can make all your problems with the guards go away, but it'll cost you. What do you say? Please, make my problems with the guards go away. Done. Now move along before you get me in trouble. All right, at least I'm appropriately visible. All right, it's time to get to the Emperor's ship. It'll be much easier to move about if I don't have a bounty on my head.
right, I could call Shadowmere, but I think I'm close enough that I can run. So, I take it it's this ship out here. Hmm, the Cataraya. I wonder if I should wait until night. Not why bother. Whatever happened to sneaking? something all right all right so much for coming on board quietly you know I'm a little bit thirsty I can't think of anything worse than having a vampire at large on a ship. Interesting. All right, we'll have to use a bit of stealth so as not to alert the entire ship.
And now the hunt begins. one drop of blood. Alright, it looks like the only way to continue is up. Not as sneaky as I was hoping. And these are the supposed well-trained Oculatus guards I see. Alright, so, I was surprised to see that body. Lieutenant Salvaris, I don't remember attacking him. Why would he be dead on the floor? And it wasn't by my hand. Looks like we're going up again. Let me make some preparations. Looks like the hammering is coming from behind that door. Alright, I must take a look. What was that?
quite awkward indeed. Who was this? Solitude guard. of blood. It looks like I've taken out all of the oculatus. Huh, is this where the, the Emperor sits? wonder, though, why would the Solitude Guard be attacking the Penitus Oculatus? It's very strange. as sloppy and messy as that was, they're all dead. Now, let me see about the Emperor. Someone's creeping about here. Got a murderer on the loose. <laughs>
All right. a stop to that hammering. <laughs> All right, I've never fed this well in quite some time. Bid you rise. <laughs> Follow me. Good man. You won't regret it. <laughs> I bet you yes? didn't expect that. Huh? What's going on here? Why are these men dead? I didn't kill them. This is quite strange. Captain. I'm gonna find whoever did this. Well, he's right behind you. And I'm sure that there's nothing that you're going to do to stop him. Okay, where is the Emperor? I believe we'll have to go up another level. What can I do for you, friend? Wait. If you say so. I'm not sure if I can come back out this way. I may not ever see you again. Who knows? And once more, I prove Commander Morrow the fool. <laughs> I told you, you can't stop the Dark Brotherhood. Never could. 
Emperor. Come now. Don't be shy. You haven't come this far just to stand there gawking. No, I'm hardly gawking. You and I have a date with destiny, it would seem. Yes, we but do. So it is with assassins and emperors, hmm? Yes, I must die. And you must deliver the blow. It is simply the way it is. But I wonder, would you suffer an old man a few more words before the deed is done? I actually wouldn't. I've brought my father's greatsword. He was killed by Imperial soldiers and agents, all under your command. And I'm here to slay you with that sword, and it will complete my mission here in Skyrim. My revenge will be complete. And I am not going to stand around and listen to your come pomp on. and circumstance. You haven't come this far just to stand. Oh, shut up. How dare you, you fool. And let me drink of your blood. There, father, you have been avenged. <laughs> and what do we have here, our master key? Emperor robes. I'm sure I could put those somewhere. Nothing else. Who is this? A courier? Are you here for me? You. I bet you've something have. I'm supposed to deliver. Your hands only. Really? So you're going to come to the scene of an assassination of the Emperor? I've been looking for you. Got something I'm supposed to deliver. All right, Captain. Yes? Follow me. Excellent. Are you going to give me something I've or been not? Looking for you. Oh, shut That's up. something I'm supposed to deliver. Your hand. All right. Feast your eyes, Captain. The Emperor is dead. <laughs> Not only dead, not only slain by my father's yes. sword, but he's been drained of all blood. That's it. Take a closer look. I just want you to know who I am. Oh, look. He was reading a book on the Dark Brotherhood. <laughs> yes, he was prepared for his end. Oh. Good idea. Maybe I should sit in his chair. Quite comfortable. You know, you must savor the moment of a kill. All right, it's time for us to leave. Captain, if you will. He won't. 
Alright, there's no place to travel. Let's take a look at my map and see where I'm supposed to go next. Oh, back to Amon Motier. I suppose I should get paid for killing the Emperor. Although I did it <laughs> for my own personal revenge. Quite free of charge. I've been looking for you. Got something I'm supposed to deliver. Yes, or yes. Yes. Let's see here. I have a letter here for you. Looks like that's it. Got to go. Captain, I'm glad you were able to keep up. All right, so let's see what this letter is all about. This is the second attempt on delivering it. I wanted to read this, too. What is this about a settlement needs help? Broken Tower Redoubt. I think that's been completed. my writ of passage. Here. Friana Mudstalker. Carnabus Rollins. <laughs> I know you killed her. Don't worry. I won't tell anyone. In fact, I wanted to thank you. She will not be missed. All right, Friana Mudstalker. All right, Captain, with me. You know, as I'm thinking about it, I probably should have resurrected the Emperor as a vampire. <laughs> and brought him back here to Amon Motier. <laughs> Hey, you mix potions, right? Let me know if you need anything, or take a seat by the fire, and I'll send someone over. Well, I'll be damned. We heard you were dead. Motier's in the back room if you've got business. Hmm? Captain. Cap what can I do for you, friend? If you'd be so kind as to wait here. If you say so. Sadia. I don't think you want to be in here. If it's work you're looking for, Hulda's the one to talk to. <coughs> Sadia, you need to leave. If you need more food or drink, speak to Hulda. Mind your manners and pay your bills, and you'll always be welcome. Hmm. Ah, very well. I might have to just add another body to my list. All right, Mr. Motier. Aha! You're back. Titus Mead the second lies dead. I know, I know. I received the news not moments ago. <laughs> this is glorious. My friend, you may not realize it, but you have served the Empire, indeed all of Tamriel, in ways you cannot possibly imagine. Ah, but you care little for politics, am I right? You want money, and money you shall have. Your payment waits for you at a dead drop. It is inside an urn, in the very chamber where we first met, in Volenwood. Now please, go. Collect your money, and let us never look upon one another again. Our business, thank the gods, is concluded. <laughs> so, need some. Once was a hero named Ragnar. Did you plant this woman? To, to prevent me from I can do for killing you. you? All right, let's go collect our. But 
Yes? Follow me. Excellent. I'd be dead if not for Big Nor. He took oh. me in and helped oh. me turn my... All right, let me get the money. urn here the last time I don't remember well 20,000 gold All right nothing new in there they even cleaned up the black sacrament all right captain let's go to the Dark Brotherhood Sanctuary. You will probably have to remain out here. I think the same rules apply to this sanctuary. Don't. Well, welcome to the Dark Brotherhood. Well, well, Nazir. It's good well, to see you. What word of the Emperor? Titus Mead the Second is dead. By my father's sword. Truly? Could you have brought us more wondrous news? Recent events notwithstanding, this is a happy day for us, my friend. Despite your misfortunes, you stayed true to the Dark Brotherhood. You've saved us all. And for this, you have my eternal thanks. Now, of course, I must ask. Killing the Emperor, how much did Motier pay for such a thing? <laughs> Twenty thousand gold. Ha! Remarkable. Well, the old bastard certainly made it worth your while, didn't he? Now, might I offer some advice? You should go to Riften and find Delvin Mallory. I believe Astrid had you visit him once before. Mallory is an expert obtainer of goods. We can use the money to repair and refit the sanctuary. Make a true home for us, huh? You do that, and I'll see what I can do about recruiting some new additions to our family. <laughs> Indeed. Indeed. All right, Captain. I think we're about to take a trip to Riften. Follow me.